Hello everyone, my name is Denise. This morning I'd like to talk to you about some of the things that the Lord has been saying to me. But before I do this, I'd like to explain some of the different ways that I hear from the Lord. And the reason I'm doing this is because many times I hear prophets or prophetic people would come and they would say that I've heard from the Lord. And I myself would wonder, how did this person hear from the Lord? Was it through a dream, a vision? How did they actually hear? And so for this reason, I'll be explaining some of the ways that I hear from the Lord. Also, to help anyone who may be interested in the prophetic and how it works. Okay, I hear from the Lord audibly just as I'm speaking now and you can hear me. This is one of the ways that I hear from the Lord. I also hear through dreams and visions. There are also times when I would have downloads of information where I would know everything that took place as if I was there when the event happened. Okay, those are some of the ways that I hear from the Lord. Right. Okay. Um, today I'll be talking about the Corona virus, that the virus is mutating. This is what the Lord is saying to me. I did a video previously about the virus mutating, but the Lord kept on speaking to me constantly that this virus is mutating it is changing form. So when these tests are done, it will not pick up this virus because it's a totally different virus. And many people are thinking the virus has been eradicated or it's slowing down. But the Lord is saying, this is not the case. The Lord is saying it is mutating. You know, I thought I would not do another video of this, but the Lord is speaking again and again about this virus. And so this is a reason I've decided to do this, um, this video again. I'll run through a list of the different times that the Lord has spoken to me about the virus that is mutating. It's, it hasn't gone anywhere. It's coming back again. On the 5th of May, 2020, I had a dream that the virus is mutating, as I've just said. On May, again, the Lord reminded me that the, the virus is mutating. So continually he's reminding me, you know, and the thing is many people, they've gone out, they've gone out, no thought, no care that this virus has not gone. They believe it's time to get out their houses after being in for a while and they're just not taking any care, any precaution whatsoever to keep themselves safe. Again, on the 14th of May, I dreamt that people were dying again from the virus. People were dying again and these are prophetic dreams. People were dying again from the virus. On May the 21st, again, I had, I heard that the virus is mutating. I heard in the spirit realm that the virus is mutating. On the 21st, there are three different occasions. Again, on the 21st of May 2020, I heard someone telling me in the spirit realm that the virus is mutating. And I replied, I heard myself in the spirit realm replying and responding, saying, yes, I know that it's mutating. So I could hear what is unfolding in the spirit realm that is about to face us here in the natural. I said, yes, I know it is mutating. 
then again on the 21st on three separate occasions on the 21st of May 2020. The Lord again showed me in a vision I saw where people were on the beach in crowds, hundreds of people on the beach lying out very close to each other. And in the vision, I was so scared for these people. I was looking on thinking the virus is mutating. I was so troubled when I saw the vision because I knew that this virus has not gone anywhere. So that was on the 21st as well, this vision. And then again on the 1st of June, I heard that the coronavirus is spreading. The coronavirus is spreading. And you know, I've spoken on my previous videos that I hear things in the spirit realm before they manifest here in the natural. So I'm hearing what is to come. The virus is spreading. Again, on the 2nd of June, 2020, I heard the pandemic is spreading right now. So it's a pandemic and it's spreading. This is what I heard on the 2nd of June, 2020. And so the Lord is speaking over and over again for us not to take it lightly, not to be thinking or be comfortable that this virus has gone because it hasn't gone. And the vaccine that they are developing, it will not work. It will cause more harm than make anyone better. So I'm encouraging you, take precaution when you go out on the street, not because we've seen the government setting these rules and regulation and they, they are not abiding by it. And that has caused a lot of people to think that, you know, this is not true. It is not what it is because if the government is not adhering to the rules that they've set, then, you know, it can't be that serious. And so people are just going out not listening, you are not doing the, you know, you are not abiding by the rules, you are setting the rules, so why should I, why should we, this is what the people are saying, and so they going out, you know, just like that, without any care, without any precaution, and I believe this virus is gonna come back, and it's probably gonna take more lives than it did originally, so this is why I want to do this video again, as I've said, because when the Lord, you know, kept speaking over and over again, I know that it is going to be severe. It is going to be severe, brethren. So, you know, take heed. The virus is mutating. It's not gone anywhere at all. And it's going to come back, I believe, with a vengeance. Thank you for listening. But before I go... I would also like to say if there's anyone who don't know Christ as their personal saviour, to do so before it's too late. Tomorrow is not promised to any man and we could die in our sins at any time. Also, for those who once received Christ, but they've turned away from the faith, I encourage you to return to him before it's too late. As I have said, tomorrow is not promised to any man. So be ready for when the Lord returns. Because if we die in our sins, then it will be too late. Those are my few words for today. Thank you for listening. Take care. God bless you. Bye-bye.